MCAT tutors here at Inspira Advantage, where we help students get into med school and other professional programs. Today, we're going to talk about lipid structure and function. Lipids are an important class of biomolecules that play a crucial role in the structure and function of biological membranes. In this video, we will discuss what lipids are, their structure, and their function. First, what are lipids? Lipids are a class of biomolecules that are characterized by their hydrophobic nature. They are insoluble in water and soluble in organic solvents. Lipids are diverse in their structure and function, and they are involved in several biological processes, including energy storage, membrane structure, and cell signaling. Let's discuss the structure of lipids. Lipids are made up of two components, a polar head and a nonpolar tail. The polar head group can be made of a phosphate group, a glycerol molecule, or a sugar molecule, while the nonpolar tail can be a fatty acid chain. A fatty acid chain is a long string of carbons with a carboxylic acid group chaining them together. Fatty acids can be either saturated or unsaturated. Unsaturated means that they have double bonds in the chain. Saturated means that the carbon chain has no double bonds. Saturated fatty acids can pack together more tightly, whereas the unsaturated fatty acids can't pack together well because the double bonds create little kinks. This affects the properties of the fatty acids. For example, butter is solid at room temperature because it is a saturated fatty acid whereas vegetable oils are liquid at room temperature because their fatty acids are unsaturated, which interferes with the ability of the fatty acids to pack together. There are also several types of lipids that you'll want to know for the MCAT. These include phospholipids, glycolipids, cholesterol, and triglycerides. Phospholipids are the main component of biological me membranes, and they consist of a polar head group and two fatty tails. Glycolipids contain a sugar molecule within the head group, as well as two fatty acid tails, and cholesterol is a type of liquid that is important for maintaining the fluidity of biological membranes and is important for building steroid hormones. Triglycerides are lipids that are useful for storing energy as well as in adipose tissue, and they look like this guy up here. Cholesterol also has an interesting role in signaling, but I quickly want to show you how it works. So cholesterol, because it is nonpolar, can easily just cross the lipid mem membrane. Within the cell, the lipid molecule is going to find another one, the cholesterol or cholesterol derivative and bind together. We call this dimerization. So now we essentially have two cholesterols bound together. This double cholesterol can then translocate into the nucleus. Again, this is a nonpolar molecule, so there's no problem crossing this nonpolar membrane, where it will then act as a transcription factor. It'll bind to the DNA and cause an increase in transcription, increase in transcription of particular genes. In this video, we discussed lipid structure and function, an important class of biomolecules that play a crucial role in the structure and function of biological membranes. We learned about the structure of lipids and their different types, as well as their functions in a living organism. We hope you found this video informative and helpful. Thank you so much for watching our video on lipids and their functions, and I will see you next time.